Most of the underground work is automated and no one works near the front anymore. The production control takes place from a bright and pleasant control room above ground or collaborative visualisation rooms as they are called nowadays. The routine monitoring work has been automated. With AI you get better stability in production, at least until something completely unexpected happens. Then our skills are needed. Our professional role has been extended to include the entire value flow from mountain to customer. Of course, we do not control the flow, but it's a transparent system where we can see how our work contributes to the bigger picture. If we see an opportunity for improvement, we can switch over to our digital twin to experiment and test the outcome. Then we have access to a large amount of logged production data that we can dig into. Data mining, they call it. We have a flat organisation and I've learned a lot at work through this programming, production planning. I've even been involved in the development of the new mining machines. It's always fun if you can trim the production and then not only financial measures apply, but also so-called green measures such as saving water or reducing greenhouse gas emissions. We're quite proud that our company takes a great social responsibility, not only for the environment, but for a prosperous society that can offer a rich social and cultural environment. When something goes wrong in the production, it's indicated in our mobile phones and usually we can solve it with a few keystrokes. But sometimes we have to go into a VR model and maybe direct a robot to a crusher to break apart a boulder. If the error has not occurred before, we sometimes have to go down into the mine to understand what has happened. Then we can bring the entire production control in our mobile tablets so we can quickly restart the production flow. When we're forced to go down into the mine, we always wear a safety vest with sensors so that one can follow where we are and warn if any dangerous environmental factors appear or if something seems strange to our health. It's a pleasant atmosphere at our workplaces. For many of us who are a little older, it was difficult to learn the new systems, but the company wisely realised the value of our experience, especially when the new system should be started up. Nowadays, the level of education is high among all employees. We've gained many new valuable impressions because many employees come from other cultures and the even gender balance has had a positive impact on our well-being. It used to be that there were only men here, but now we're almost 50-50. Last month, my daughter even started working for the company. She's a computer science major, but works as much with my colleagues as she does with a computer. It feels good to know that there will be a new generation and that young people have stopped moving away. It seems the company's investments in the community and insistence on training and using locals really paid off. Thank you.